So let's just get right into it, guys. What's your excuse for not having more money in the bank? What's your excuse for not driving that car you love so much or living in that neighborhood you so desire? What's your excuse for not finishing school? Or better yet, what's your excuse for not going back to school? What's your excuse for not moving up in the company you work at? Or what's your excuse for not starting that business that you've always dreamed of? What is your excuse and when do you say enough is just enough? Because there's a small fraction of the population that will not allow any excuse, not one, to get between them and their dreams. Are you one of those people? I remember when I was in school, in college, and um, we were pledging at the time, and we were forced to memorize this creed, and it started off something to the effect of, excuses are the tools of the incompetent built on monuments of nothing. And that's exactly what they are. They're tools of the incompetent built on monuments of absolutely nothing. They're figments of our imagination. They are problems that require us to just dig a little deeper to become solution oriented. They are distractions. They are the pause button that most of us turn in to the stop sign. Enough is enough with these excuses. I love stories that really exemplify the human spirit and really show all of us that there's nothing that us as human beings can't overcome. We all remember several years ago when those pipe bombs went off at the Boston Marathon. People's lives would change forever. People lost their lives. People lost limbs. But here's what I remember more. I remember seeing those signs almost right away that said Boston Strong, that just showed the resilience of the human spirit. And then fast forward a year later, people who lost limbs and now have prosthetics, seeing them at the starting line of that marathon, and watching their journey, they just had to finish that thing that they started and watching them come across that finish line with their hands up. No excuse, no excuse is acceptable. It was beautiful to watch it. It was beautiful to watch that willpower and that human spirit. What's your excuse? So often I listen to people and they're like, I want to buy a new home or I want to start my new business, but I just don't have the down payment. I don't have enough money, but you got enough money for the weed man every day. Are you kidding me? What is your excuse? Or sometimes when you see people on public transportation and they got these newborn babies and the babies got on these new Jordan and designer clothes and you're like, yo, you the, the, the baby's foot is going to grow out of that by next month. And you re-open, re in month over month over month. But you're on public transportation and won't take that same money and go out there and buy yourself a car. What is your excuse? Because, guys, we got to look at this thing like life and death. Because that's exactly what it is. Our lives, the lives that we currently know, it depends on it. No excuse. What's stopping you? We, you know, we all got access to the internet. There's no real problem out there that we can't just punch in Google and, and at least get us started on a solution. Everybody's like, oh, I don't have time to go back to school. I don't have time to read books. But you got time to listen to podcasts and the Breakfast Club interviews for two and three hours out your day. But you can't listen to an audio book that is going to help feed your mind and increase your skill set. Stop with the excuses. No excuse is acceptable. My man, Eric Thomas, he said it better than I probably ever could. And, and it's just so damn poetic. He said, when you want success as much as you want to breathe, 
That is the only time that you're going to be successful. Preach. They call him E.T. the hip hop preacher for a reason. Like really think about it. Try holding your breath for a minute, two minutes. And that you, because you need that air. And it ain't until that point, like, like really think about it figuratively. When you want success, like you have to get that breath of air to survive. That is the only time that success is going to come your way. Because you got to want it as much as you want to breathe. No excuses, guys. No excuses. You gotta ask yourself, if you're not exactly where you wanna be in this life, if you're not living, you're not driving, you're not doing, you don't have the money in your bank account that you want, I need you to ask yourself, what is my excuse? Peace and love make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.